quick story. My sister, my stepsister, she is fully black. And the only reason why I'm saying that is because she knew better. Like, there's no, you knew better. So Memorial Weekend, my mother called me and set me up for the UWAM to come in town from Atlanta to Virginia to be a part of this family cookout. Little did I know I was doing like all the cooking. They planned a whole cookout, but nobody knew how to cook. And she was going to California. So she called me in town to come do that. It's no thing. You know what I mean? I do whatever for my mom, Duke. So I'm pulling up. So she like, yeah, we need you to make the salmon, yada, yada, woo. And Chelsea and her friend, that's my sister, and her friend are going to make the side. I'm like, okay, bet. That's cool. You know, whatever. But they was coming down from Baltimore and I got there first. So me and my stepdad went ahead onto the store, went shopping. I'm in the car and he read me the list. He like potatoes. I'm like, all right, mayonnaise, cool, eggs. I'm like, oh, you make a potato salad? He's like, yeah, Chelsea and a friend make a potato salad. I'm like, oh, why? Right. Then he's like, Dijon, celery, carrots, apple cider vinegar. And I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's a lot of ways to make potato salad, but that's not the one. That's not the one for me. So we come back, put the groceries up. I leave to make a run. When I come back, it's like some cars there. So I got an auntie that's disabled. So we have like caregivers and things, people that come for her. But my step pops is walking down the steps with this white girl. And I'm just thinking it's the caregiver. So he introduced me to her. And I'm like, oh, hey, how you doing? And he's like, oh, this Chelsea best friend. And I'm like, the, the one that's about to make the potato, this who about to make the potato salad. Now, one thing about us, we don't play by no macaroni and cheese, no potato salad, no family function. You have one person dedicated to do this shit every time. Or that's it. Like, you don't substitute. You damn sure don't bring no outside family member to do that shit. And no offense to nobody, but you don't bring no white girl to the cookout to make essential dishes. Like, she could have brought some red cup, some napkin, corn. I don't know. She could have brought anything. So, I commenced the cooking. This girl commenced the cooking. Y'all, that potato salad had mushy mashed potatoes in it. Raw eggs. I'm talking about the yolk. Damn near about to run away. It was dry. It was so dry. <laughs> no seasoning. All she put was like some celery salt in there. I'm talking about not no paprika, no onion powder, no garlic powder, no salt, no pepper, just some celery salt. And the shit was crunchy from all the carrots and the onions and the celery. So it was like mushy, runny, and cr I couldn't do it. I just left that shit there. Like it was a whole pan of that shit. Mom's like, don't you say nothing. I'm like, I, she knew better. Like, why would you do that? Like, why would you, and and y'all know me. Why would you put me in a situation to where I got to not say something so hard? It was egregious. It was offensive. It was treason. It was black blasphemy.